James Unboxer and today I'm going to be unboxing this cool power block. Hope you enjoyed the video and let's get started. Ta da! So let's just take it out. First impressions look at how thick this cable is, okay? So let, let's untie the cable. So we've got rid of this annoying thing. They're very annoying sometimes. And, uh, Whoa, okay, so on the box it says that this is a one metre long cable. Yeah, it's pretty long and it's it's really, really annoying because it just goes back to the same position. It's, it's so thick, I can't get over how thick it is. If we look at this instruction, user manual here. So this is a USB surge protected power block and you can buy it in black as well. So here we go, we got the white or black version. So guys, this can go up to 255 volts. I mean, that's that's quite a lot. Now actually looking at the physical sides of stuff, I presume that's to like probably mount it, but we have some anti-slip pads here to stop it from moving along the table. And we got the four, the four plug sockets and the two USB sockets. This is what is unique about this, is it has two USB sockets. I mean, that is really handy. What you need to do is plug it in. Ta-da, we plugged it in. And you can see straight away we have the two lights on top and you can just plug in whatever you want. So inside we also get a warranty leaflet just in case it's damaged or broken. And as you can see that the cable is kind of pulling, pulling it along because it's not going down. The cable needs to straighten out a bit before it can actually sit still. And as you can see we have two lights so we have the power button, the power light and the surge light so that's if there's a, a surge of electricity and it doesn't explode which is that's kind of useful this is pretty good for setups i mean it looks nice it's very minimalistic and it looks much better than what your usual power block would look like i mean considering they're usually flat and long and disgusting it looks pretty good and you got the usb because that's an, also a big add-on because usually in power blocks we don't have them which is annoying but I have to say, it is a bit pricey. It comes in at £13, so... I mean, it, it, it should show that it doesn't explode, hopefully. The cable does stretch pretty far. I, I'm gathering it will stretch further when it's not so stiff. It's a bit stiff at the moment. I'm gathering that's because it's a bit fat. So that's a bit of a downside, but no worries. We got this from Audi. I'm not sure where you can get other ones like this from. I'm sure you can buy them online, but we got this from Audi, which is a UK shop. Uh, there's not Audis in America, unfortunately. I will try to link a power block like this in the description for America as well. I also like the design a lot with the gray on top. And it's actually silver to be honest and white. The only downside is it's plastic, it's kind of plasticky. It does feel pretty solid though, it's solid. But you can get all your fingerprints over it because it's all glossy. It looks quite nice when it's glossy. I'm sure if it was matte, it wouldn't look too nice. If you got the black version, as you can see, we got all those fingerprints on it and you can see all those disgusting fingerprints. And as always, we got the gray on top. Guys, overall, I think this product is a very good buy and I would definitely recommend it. Look at this. It looks pretty cool. All you have to do is plug it into the wall and you're good to go with your surge protection so it doesn't explode, which is always a plus. So guys, I hope you enjoyed my video. This is a bit of an odd one. I haven't done a power block and I haven't really seen very many power block reviews. So I'm not sure whether you guys should have been liked it. But I hope you did. If you didn't, leave a dislike, please, and tell me what I have, could do to improve. That would help greatly. So I hope you guys all enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a thumbs up, leave a comment down below saying what you would like to see next. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you all for watching and I appreciate it very much. Thank you.